What's going on? Uh, video number dose for today on the uh, on the iPhone Cinco. Um, the one I did earlier, like I said, was the first one filming it with with the iPhone five. So um, I felt I filmed it straight up. So I thought if I did it sideways, it would uh. It wouldn't look right. It, the, the video would come out sideways when I uploaded it. Um, so it's real, real narrow. So I'm, I'm trying this one, recording it sideways. See, see, see. Uh, yeah, pretty smart. Let me work this out. I'll see how it works this way. There we go. Uh, stay in school, kids. Um, so yeah. We got two Nike Sportswear um, review slash comparison. Um, the first one is a 2007 release. Air Trainer SC High, white, light, zen, gray, total orange, and stealth. Just by that, you should know what it is. Um, Style 302, 346, color 106. No box on that. I think they were 100 then. Air Trainer SC High, size 13 on this one. Um, white, light, zen, gray, total orange, and stealth. Same style, same color. Box on these is 110. Um, I got the size 12 a couple months ago. These are... Uh, Semi grail, um, so I guess maybe they're not a grail, but it's it's kind of there. So uh, I wanted them so bad, kept passing on them on eBay, and then finally when I wanted when I fight said you know the hell with it, I'm gonna buy them. Um, couldn't find them, so uh, my man had a size 12 that he wore like I don't know twice. Um, so I, I just grabbed them for 80. Figured you know what the hell. I've worn them a couple times since, so we'll do a little comparison. This is the size 12 from uh, 07. And these are the fresh boards from 2013. Yes, the size is a little different. Let's first get it out of the way to see if there's a height difference. Um, I don't know if there is a little bit of a height difference, but that could be contributed. That could be attributed to um, the size. Not sure, but from the back, um, again, one's worn, one isn't. Um, so some of, some of the things I can't give you 100% on. Um, you see, it looks like the size 12 on the right is a little wider in the back, and the size 13 from this year isn't as wide. But that could be due to some wear. Not 100% sure. But okay, now. Start with um, we'll start with leather quality. Um, the leather on this is nice. It's it's uh it's not as far as I remember. It, it never was butter soft leather on these. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna say it's identical leather. Um, Yeah, I'm gonna say I'm gonna say it's right. Let me zoom this. See right right there in this section from here to here. This little <clears throat> you can see how that's just one portion of leather. Just this little section of leather. And then you have the same section. You don't see you don't see the grain as much. This section here, 
doesn't feel as soft as it does over here. Um, but that's the only section of the leather that um, <coughs> feels any different. Um, let's try to speed this along. The leather on the swoosh is the same. The plastic here, the same. It's a little brighter on the 2013, just slightly. Uh, the new buck. It's nice on here. You can see it, it changes. It changes the nap a little bit. Um, on here, I don't feel like it's gonna do that. Yeah. Yeah, you can see it. It's doing it. So that's about the same. Um, you got Nike. Uh, orange with the blue Nike. Orange with the blue Nike. The tongue here is the same. With your Nike and then your blue. Um... This is way more padded. You see how see how thick that is. You see it's thinner here. Let me see if um, you see it's a little thinner. And then uh, here, padding is about the same. Um, they're already in six minutes. Um, the nylon on this is, is stiffer. I like it a little better on this. It's a little softer. Um, the color of blue. Is, I'd say, identical. Um, color of gray. It's a little darker on a 2013 on your swoosh. Your bottom, hold on, I gotta put you down for a minute. Your bottom. Um, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say the 2013 is, is very, very, very slightly brighter orange. Very slightly. That everything else identical. Um, so yeah, I mean it's a super classic shoe. Um, one of my favorite of all time. Um, I really do love the SE Trainer. This is my favorite colorway. I don't really like a lot of colorways. Um, this just pops. I love the all. I just love the all brand colorway on this and the Trainer too. It's a great shoe. It's $110. I paid $89 on my discount. Um, but still $110. It's the same price as an Air Max 90 now. Um, so, yeah, that's ridiculous, right? They're charging $110 for an Air Max 90, and the SC trainers are $110. Like, that's ridiculous. But, um, there, there it is. Simple. Uh, let me see. Last thing. Inside... Inside of your air unit is white. Inside of your air unit is white also. So, there you go. Sick ass shoe. Um, wish I had an original to compare to these two retros. But, they are, I would say, 90 five percent identical to the past retro that being 2013 to 2007 hold on the date says uh, 2009 I'm sorry I'm sorry 2009 I think there was an 07 too but 2013-2009 that's it Bo Jackson Auburn SE Trainer, review slash comparison. All right, holler back.